Hi everybody. Um, I've, I've had a lot of people ask how I prepare tumblers in order to do tumblers on my turner. Blue painter's tape, one to one and a half inch wide. This is actually the hardest part of this entire process. What you're doing is you put this around the inside of the rim to prevent resin from running into the tumbler. It also prevents the paint that I use to prime them from getting inside as well and keeps the cup a lot cleaner when you go to do your final cleanup and prep work. So we're going to do like so. Make sure it's good and tight. You want that rim to be completely tight. Get another piece. Usually takes two. These are 30 ounce tumblers, but I work with 30 ounce, 20 ounce wine glass, wine sippies, which are 12 ounce, and then actual children's sippy cups, like with the little handles and all that. And it really, those can be a little bit of a challenge to do this with. I'm using one of my easiest ones to present to show you how this works. All right. As you see, I'm going through and making sure all air bubbles are out so that it stays sealed. Just like so. And that creates a perfect rim that resin cannot get under, paint cannot get under. Once you've done that, you take your insert Press it into place. Make sure it's in there nice and tight and comfortable. Take your stick. Mine are filthy. I apologize in advance. And insert. Now, from this point out, you do not want to touch your cup. The reason being, we're going to clean it. Let me grab some paper towels here. You have to ensure that you get as much of the oils from touching it off of the cup because otherwise your primer paint will not adhere. Spray it really well with alcohol. I use 99%. What you don't wipe off will evaporate, so do not be worried if it seems like it's still a little wet. It's nothing to be concerned about. You just don't want to get fingers on it once you have done that. I now have a nice, clean tumbler, and it's ready to be primed. I'll be back in a moment. Brought to you courtesy of Moon's Resin Designs. Hello again, folks. I am now outdoors because you never want to use spray paint when you're indoors. Trust me on this. I use Krylon Fusion All-in-One Paint and Primer. I either do them in matte white or matte black. This one will be done in white. And what you want is to create a nice even coat. This is a brand new can of paint and it's going to be a pain in the butt for me. Make sure you get your bottom. Look for any spots. They can drip. Do not be alarmed if they drip because that dripping will actually come off as they dry. I have the entire cup now painted and primed. And I will take it inside, put it on its holder, and let it sit and dry. I usually leave them at least eight hours, usually overnight, and then I work with them the next day. See? Drippy, drippy. <laughs> mm -hmm. But it's okay. All right. Thanks, guys. Hope you, hopes this helps, y'all. Bye-bye.